Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you don't know me, I'm Karande, and if you do know me, then welcome back. This is going to be another one of my weekly one word rants where I just take one word and run with it, do a TED talk, do a little improvisation. This week's word is going to be stress. Now, stress is something that everybody in life goes through, and if you haven't gone through stress, then I'm not saying you're going to go through it, but it's just a big natural thing. It's not exactly anxiety, but stress is just when life's life and in it's getting a little hard to hold in there. Stress feels kind of crazy. Like, it's so crazy how stress can build up and cause so many actual health problems. That's why I try not to get stressed at all. Even though things can be stressful, you don't have to feel the stress of it. Now, is that easy? No, I'm not saying that. But I'm saying it's a big help when you're able to face stressful situations with a calm, peaceful mind. Stress is something that I really recommend. If you have a lot of it, Try to work on not 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 letting it get to you because i know situations in life are real things aren't fake and things are not going to be easy for everyone i'm a person that honestly i've been stressed since a child i've I have had anxiety since a child in a way i was upraised i just knew i don't know a lot of things around me were causing stressors like triggers and stuff like that so uh take it from me personally living life with a peaceful mind has changed things tremendously I still I'm diagnosed generalized anxiety. I'd say this because again I just want to help. I'm diagnosed with generalized anxiety disorder, obsessive compulsive disorder, and bipolar disorder, bipolar one. So as a person with those things, I'm not on any medication currently and I'm not seeing any therapist because it's just a thing that happened <laughs> over the years. But I plan again to go to therapy. I said this in another video. But through my own methods in i don't know i just learned how to cope with stress without feeling the stress like even my anxiety i don't feel much anxiety anymore i do feel it sometimes still but i can't even go in stores now and stuff and deal with all the strangers and people without feeling any anxiety or stress which is major 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 i really recommend trying to get your best peace of mind it might be hard but you really had to dig deep and find what does that for you for me personally it's a little bit of music you know I let it out like I'll put it turn on music for the mood and just sing my heart out like literally I wish I could show y'all maybe one day I will but I'll be uh going a little in but that really helps me balance out the stressors because that's why I make music too I put all my emotions in my lyrics so I don't let my negative emotions pour into my actual day you can do that or you can do things like journal because journaling if you have nobody to talk to to vent to journal I write hard like sister get that stress out people don't know but emotions if you suppress them you may think it's gone just because it feels like it's gone but suppressing just really lets it build up and simmer in your body you know what simmering does makes things hotter slowly but shortly my best method to release stress is to get it out but you have to figure out what way that works best for you some people love the gym love to i think about doing kickboxing because i have a lot of things i could punch get into you know so Things like that if you're not into journaling or writing of course you can do other things cry crying is a major thing for me but just do it like in a peaceful place maybe the bathroom your room if you can do that but the main thing is just getting it out in your way drawing something getting it out really will help even if you don't think it will i bet i was one of those people i would be like i don't want to write because what is that going to do but then i started like journaling and then write my music with my emotions behind it and it made things so much better like so much better now every time I feel an emotion, I can like deal with it, of course, in real life, but I can go right to the pen and pencil and let it all out there. Even write a letter to yourself or something or to the stressor, you can cuss them out. They don't gotta see it, y'all. It's something for you to let out. But yeah, that is this weekly one word rant on stress and I really hope this helped you in any way possible. You know, maybe some of my tips, but yeah. I enjoy making these really, <laughs> I really enjoy making these videos. So leave any words that you want me to do a video on next in the comments. And make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in my next video.